Fixold Cameras produces step-by-step, close-up videos of simple, common repairs and basic maintenance on classic and vintage cameras. Your ability, the quality of your tools, and the condition of your camera will affect the success of your repair endeavor. A successful completion of the demonstrated repairs ultimately depends on your camera repair skills. The OM10 viewfinder screen can be accessed and removed from the mirror box so that it can be cleaned. However, it is somewhat involved. First, remove the mirror cushion pad. Sometimes it will peel out in one piece, but most often it is degraded and will just crumble as you try to remove it. The cushion in the OM10 does not get gooey and sticky like those found in some classic cameras. If any of the crumbly pieces should end up on the viewfinder screen, generally a light puff of air will remove these. Once the mirror pad is removed, seep some alcohol underneath the plastic ceramic circuit cover. When the glue on the ceramic cover plate has sufficiently softened, gently pry the plate free. Underneath the plate will be the viewfinder clip retaining screw. Remove the screw with a cross point screwdriver. Tweezers will probably be needed to remove the clip. With the viewfinder screen clip out of the way, catch the edge of the screen with the tweezer tip and gently drop the front edge down. Remember, these Fresnel lenses scratch very easily. To clean the viewfinder screen, use a blower brush or a natural bristled artist brush or a little hand pump blower. In this case, we're going to use the hand pump blower. The few dust specks present are effectively removed with the blower. When placing the screen back into position, be aware of the two clips at the back of the mirror box. The clips must be pulled down in order for the viewfinder screen to clear and slide into place. Once they are on the back side of the clips, the viewfinder screen can be pushed up into position. Hold the edge of the viewfinder screen so that the screen can stay in the position needed as the clip is installed. A magnetic screwdriver helps in accessing the screw. With the viewfinder clip installed, the cover plate can be glued back into position with a dab of Plyabon glue. Be very careful not to get any glue onto the viewfinder screen as this will scar the plastic. One millimeter light seal foam can be used as the mirror pad. Test fit for the length of the foam strip, making a cutting mark with the tips of your tweezers. A cute little camera with a clean viewfinder screen. Thank you for watching.